It's kind of hard to get your head around this timeline that we're living in. Just a couple months ago, I thought that Charlie XCX's Brat was going to be like a project for the hardcore fans, a club record that was going to satisfy her really day ones. And now it's being used as part of a presidential campaign. So you've probably already seen, but the Camilla HQ Twitter account is now using the Brat font and colour in its header, obviously playing into this whole like Brat summer thing and getting Gen Z on board as well. And then Charlie XCX tweeted about Kamala as well. It's just so wild. Like, this is an album that finishes with a line about bumping cocaine off a key, or whatever your choice is. Charlie XCX is a British artist who has, for most of her career, operated on the periphery of mainstream pop music and now is directly being used, or being discussed at least, in the marketing team for a presidential campaign. This is just so funny. Like, she's not even American. She's, up until the past two months, not really been a mainstream focus. And now the Brat Summer has extended so far that it's probably going to extend into Brat election season. How am I even saying that? I understand why it's being done. Gen Z has kind of cottoned onto Brat Summer in a really heavy way. It's kind of driven a lot of the success of Brat, and I guess they're kind of hoping that the Gen Zers will get on board with this campaign as well. Doesn't make it any less funny. Anyway, let's get Brat to number one.